Welcome back to Endis Guides. In today's video, we are going to show you how to export your mirror board to a PDF. Let's begin. Now, the first thing that you need to do is to log in using your credentials. If this is your first time here in Miro, click the sign up option. And from here, just follow the on screen instructions and you're good to go. Exporting your mirror board to a PDF file is a very easy and a straightforward process, especially when it comes to sharing, archiving, and presenting information effectively. Because PDF is a widely accepted format for sharing documents. Exporting your mirror board like this one to PDF allows you to easily distribute it to team members, stakeholders, collaborators, your company, or clients who may not have access to Miro or prefer a static document. Now, how do we do it? First off, what we need to do here is now, if you wanted to export this to a PDF, it's a very easy, very, very easy. All you're going to do is go to the upper left corner. You say this one, export this board and you will be given a um, dialogue saving um, option. Save as image. We're not going to do with that. Instead, save as PDF. Now, the thing is, all right. If you wanted to share this file instead of a PDF and save it to Google Drive, you can do so. But for now, we're going to stick to the PDF file. Click on it. Now, if you encounter a window like this one, export board as PDF, you need at least one visible frame on the board. Make sure the frame is not hidden. Each frame will become a separate page in the file. Just click on add a frame. It's that easy. All right, so maybe let's uh, go for the phone and that's uh, that. All right. And again, just click on it and save as PDF. All right. You have an option to export PDF in small file size or you can upgrade to export this board in best quality. When you click on it, it would be forwarded here. Now select um, the starter pack, which is $8 per month. And you only have one member for that. And you get all these uh, free features plus, all right, all these. Now, if you're planning to scale up, which is going to be the business for advanced collaboration, you can scale collaboration beyond your team with advanced features and security. That's going to be business, $16 per month. And of course, you will be billed annually of $20 and you can have a one member. Try it free and you can cancel anytime if you don't feel it's not working for you. And in terms of the enterprise, I suggest, of course, you contact the sales professionals here on Miro to give you a demo or the uh, some uh, advice so that they can give you a consultation for free. All right. Let's skip that. Instead, if you click on export. Now, there are several platforms that you can save with the PDF file, including, of course, Google Drive, transfer your file like this one. And when you finish uploading the file, just share it. All right. Click on this option. And click on copy link. Now, the next platform that you can utilize is, of course, Canva. And from once your PDF is up, up, uploaded here, just click on share. And of course, you can give the collaborator link. Anyone with the link or only you can access. Another option is tiny.host wherein you can simply put in upload the pdf file and you can share it with your team members all right that's it for today's video thank you so much for watching we will see you again in the next one